A lot of individuals really struggle with intensity and hard training. It is the last five repetitions you have in the tank before achieving true local failure that you will grow from. If you're training shy of this threshold, which most people are, you're not being productive with your training and really just accumulating unnecessary fatigue through junk volume. So I want to make it clear that failure is much further than most individuals realize. It is truly amazing how hard you can push the human body and there are certainly levels to this mentally. The deeper you go, the darker it gets, so just keep going. This has actually been well looked at in research, and my predictions align well with the data in the fact that most individuals struggle with gauging the amount of repetitions they have left in the tank before achieving true failure. On average, most people have way more reps left than they think, but that gap does seem to close with experienced training. So I would suggest beginner lifters to train to failure very often, if not all the time on low injury risk movements to become familiar with where failure really is. It will come. I just cannot express how much faster progress you'd make by actually training hard. Even leaving three reps in the tank should be absolutely no joke at all. With that said, my recommendation would be to stick to the same training program for 5 to 15 weeks or so, and have the majority of your training be in the 2 to 0 RAR range and 2 failure on your isolation or low injury risk movements in the 5 to 10 repetition range as this will provide the best stimulus. With that said, drop a comment if you have any questions, and be sure to like and follow for more productive training.